Hi, good, good morning. morning. Good morning. morning. We are live here at the last day of the ADV Women's Rally, and I have Mara with me here today. And uh, so we'll keep this really short, but um, here, let me squeeze in so okay. we can. Um, so here's the thing. Yesterday, so Mara was one of the gals that was featured in my article with tra Traction ERAG, and um, she came out. Um, tell the story about just a little bit of what you shared with me today and, um, and and basically what happened because you had some trouble getting here actually yeah um, the week before I was trying to get ready for the rally I was trying to ride a little bit and I ended up having a dead battery and having to have my bike towed and there were 12 bikes in front of me when the mechanic looked at it on Tuesday morning oh my and it looked like I wasn't going to be coming to the rally at all at least not on a bike. And on a bike, just okay. resolved I was going to do it in the car. And I had not been able to get any sleep the night before, but I didn't think it was a big deal because I was just going to be driving in my car. Mm -hmm. And I um, get a phone call that morning, and he says, your bike's ready. All right. I'm loaning you a battery, and you can take it to the rally. And I'm thinking, oh, God, no. <laughs> I can't ride this bike. Mm -hmm. And I got up here, and Deanne said, Oh, you know, are you going um, home tonight? And I thought, yeah, I can do that. I can set up my tent and I can go home tonight and pick it up tomorrow in the morning instead of camping here and then driving back. Mm -hmm. and I got a full day of riding in and um, I was able to take not the adventure riding class, but the dirt bike riding class. Okay. And I was terrified because I hadn't slept again. Mm -hmm. And I thought, this is way beyond my skill set. And my bike's different from theirs. And I don't know how to ride on dirt. And I was just grateful I got through the parking lot. Right, right. <laughs> I didn't even drive my bike up to my tent. Oh, my goodness. And by the end of the class, I was, like, going down hills, going over logs. Right. Going, you know, all all over the campground right. parking by my tent right well so here's the thing so yesterday so yesterday was it was yesterday you were in class yeah. yesterday okay yesterday, yeah. so um, yesterday the the interesting thing was is when I we were getting ready to leave for the ride Mara said I, I I'm not gonna be jumping any logs there's just no way that's gonna happen and so I was like okay well you know just take the class and have a good time and and uh, what, and so, what? <laughs> <laughs> just see what happens and and if you do then you do and then what happened everything happened everything happened everything happened it was like you didn't know you could do these things right and there they were inside you all along and it was a big surprise to me <laughs> that's uh, <laughs> and, you, and you, right surprise, and yeah. so at the, and how did you how did you feel it at the end of it like what was a uh, I was just I had a, a real even happiness right um, just real simple joy it just felt so good and I was so relieved not to have been injured I felt so good that I was finally able to trust the bike right you know as I was going down these hills these bumpy little hills not very far but not smooth in right. any respect. Right. With rocks and things right. I'm not used to riding over. Right. I just finally trusted the bike. Right. And just kept remembering when everybody told me your bike is built to do this. Your tires are trust your tires, trust your bike. And I finally did and they didn't let me down. That's awesome. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is so awesome. So, uh, so what a great story because w there was one other thing that you mentioned. Oh yeah. So, okay. So, you know, I was, I was kind of gripped about coming here because I actually was in the article. Yeah. And I thought, isn't that going to be silly because I'm coming in my car. Right. You know, I wasn't even going to be able to ride and I had put myself out there like, oh gee, I want to learn. And, Mm -hmm. um, I was still apprehensive because I was scared when I got to the class. Mm -hmm. I, I was scared. I didn't think I could perform. I didn't think I could keep up. And I get nervous in that environment sometimes because you don't always know the social dynamic. Right. Um, and what was so impressive about this rally was that 
we had a nurturing, supportive environment that just built on small success after small success until you had something big. Right. Right. Yeah. Isn't that a beautiful thing? Well, I know you wanted to keep this short, so okay. we, we will wrap it up. But um, what an amazing uh, outcome for her. And uh, it was night and day uh, from the beginning of the day to when um, when I got back, she was she had jumped the log. She was like, <laughs> yeah. So three times. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank Peace you. out. See you guys later.